Okay, Andrew, do you have any final questions for me? When do you think I can take over your, your, your job? I think, Andrew, we need to go for a walk so that I can explain more things to you. So after the walk, I can take over? Let's go for the walk first. This. Yes. So now that I'm Mr. Lim's godson, I guess I'm set for life, right? Oh wait, I still need a job. <laughs> ah, okay, okay. My Chinese might be CMI, but I think I'm quite sporty lah. And Sports Hub is the biggest sports and entertainment venue here. But I've also heard that Sports Hub is a PPP project or public-private partnership thing. So confusing eh. But basically it means that they're responsible to financiers, the public and also the government lah. Sounds like a big company. Maybe I should give it a shot. Hello, my name is Andrew Wong. I just graduated and uh, now, you know, a bit hard to find a job, but I'm very hungry and I'll do anything to find a job. And today with me is Sports Hub CEO, Lionel. Hello everyone, my name is Lionel and I'm the CEO of the Singapore Sports Hub. I don't normally do this, but thanks to Andrew, I get a chance to be out on the Kalang Basin today. A bit of clouds, but otherwise, quite nice. The camera angle okay lah. <laughs> <laughs> Can you tell me a bit about Sports Hub? What is your vision for the company? You know, the Sports Hub is an iconic national project. You know, it's right behind us, you can see it. It's really meant to be, you know, a place where sports, entertainment and lifestyle activities take place. Sorry, there's a dead fish there. <laughs> what does a CEO do daily? Do you just get the pay? <laughs> At Sports Hub, we believe that leaders have got three roles. People issues, strategy issues and execution issues. So okay. I have to take care of people. I have to take care of the team, right? I have to take care of the strategy, and I have to take care of execution, means operations, ensure that things are running smoothly. W would you say you are a crazy rich Asian? <laughs> Definitely not. Well, Maybe crazy, but not rich. How to be as successful as you? I think you got to start by asking yourself, you know, what does success mean to you? What are you hoping to achieve? And crucially, why? Why are you working towards that success? because you need to find that as a source of motivation. In the course of a day, there's a lot of distractions, there's a lot of things that happen, right? It's just like we're underwater, right? If we don't do anything, we just go drift according to the, the current. See. But if you want to go there, then you need to be focused on the objective. Ah. You need to look ahead and paddle. Uh, li life short, paddle hard. Wow, so it's a lot less uh, shaky here. I, I think better for both of us, mini so we don't get seasick. Sure. So, um, what do you look out for in, an, in employees? We look for attitude and we look for aptitude, right? Attitude means, you know, what is the frame of mind that you bring to work? I see. You know, are you a positive person generally? I are see. you, do you work well with others? Aptitude is about your skills and your competencies. In general, while people can train for aptitude, attitude can be quite hard to change. Right. So we need to, we need to consider that very carefully in selecting people. Right. Do you check your staff's IPPT results? No, I don't. They don't hit their KPI. Do you ask them to do push-ups? No. Squats? No. Burpees? No. So n no. How does that help? Uh, it, it helps. Uh, 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 yeah, it doesn't help. Okay. Um, so how will you describe your working style? I like to hear from everyone because I, I think we have quite a diverse team that we have assembled. And there is a certain strength and wisdom in that diversity. But in order to unlock it, you have to allow people to speak. How is the work-life balance and sports up for your staff? Why don't you ask them for yourself? Other than work-life balance, got any perks now? Is it like one day you can meet Coplay or J Cho and then the next day you can see Liverpool? Are there any staff discounts or perks? We get to listen to the rehearsal of the concert that the public don't get. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Best thing about working here? You see, uh, say, Liverpool comes here to play. So Liverpool win there is fantastic. Right? Of course. Can you wear sports shoes every day? Yes! That's the best part about working here, okay? <laughs> Cannot wear heels at all really? because of our flooring. Do you get priority when you're on a book facilities? No, we don't get priorities. Then what's the point of working here? For staff, we do have a staff rate of $50 a year for the gym membership. What is it like working here? Huh? I'll just describe in five words. It's actually like very spontaneous. People here are very uh, passionate, opportunists. And we are very rewarding and trusting here. That is like 17 words you did. It's not oh. mundane. Every day you'll be able to meet new people. Can you... Spot me. And push. Push, 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 push. How often you OT? Not that often, but I do work weekends um, quite often because that's how natural um, events is. Every event is just different. And that's what makes it 
challenging in this environment. So the vending machine here, is it all 100 plus coconut water? Got no coke one. Huh? When you work here, do you have time for exercise? Uh, during lunch, after lunch, before work. During my lunch, I actually go and work out as well. No coke one. Uh? Do you think the pantry is too small? Uh, kind of. We have our personal pantry here. Is, is the grass always greener on the other side? The grass is always green here. Here? Yeah. Oh, by the way, uh, the grass is only there when there's an event. I was just kidding. Lah. <laughs> so, other than the tiny pantry, I also learned that working here is actually quite fun. You get to listen to concert rehearsals and you can wear sports shoes to work. Not bad, right? Okay, Andrew. Now, do you have any final questions for me? When can I... Take over your job. My colleagues will be in touch with you. Which, which colleague? My HR colleagues will be in touch with you very, very soon. soon. Yeah, I'm sure they'll be in touch so, with you so very soon. They'll send the letter of as, as acceptance and... Oh, okay. Let me show you the way. You show me the HR colleague? Uh, uh, yeah, sure. Uh, I can, I can, I'll, I'll show you, I'll introduce you to the HR colleague. I can pass them my number if... So, you call me, right? Sure. Okay. Yes, they'll be in touch uh, with you. I'll, I'll come back tomorrow and... Just drop me a call. Have a good day, Andrew. You too. Uh, boss, what's the latest you've stayed? Uh? 8pm. So is, is the office empty? Yeah, very quiet. Got, got, got weird sound. Uh, got the chair move on. Uh, <laughs> that kind of. Uh. Joy. <laughs>